Have you ever wondered what lies beyond the stars hidden in the vast expanses of our universe? This cosmic expanse, our universe, is a place of unimaginable scale, teeming with galaxies beyond count. Each galaxy, a swirling mass of stars, gas, and dust, is a testament to the universe's incredible complexity. The universe is so large, in fact, that it's difficult to comprehend its true size. Picture this. It's estimated that there are around 2 trillion galaxies in the universe, each housing billions if not trillions of stars. And that's just what we can see. Even more intriguing is what we can't see, the mysteries that scientists are still trying to unravel. Dark matter, dark energy, black holes, and the very nature of the universe itself are all subjects of intense study and speculation. Now brace yourself as we take a journey through the cosmos, uncovering some of its most fascinating secrets. Imagine a balloon slowly inflating. That is the universe we live in. Now, this might sound like a strange comparison, but it's a pretty accurate one. You see, the universe, in all its cosmic grandeur, is continuously expanding. And it's been doing so ever since its birth some 13.8 billion years ago with the Big Bang. But how do we know this? Well, the evidence lies in something called the redshift. Picture this. When light from distant galaxies reaches us, it's stretched or shifted to longer, redder wavelengths due to the universe's expansion. This phenomenon, discovered by Edwin Hubble in the early 20th century, was the first empirical confirmation that the universe is indeed expanding. But it's not just that the universe is getting bigger, it's the pace at which it's growing that's truly fascinating. Scientists measure this rate as the Hubble constant. Though there's still a bit of a debate about the exact value, the consensus is that it's around 70 kilometers per second per megaparsec. Now I know that sounds like a mouthful, but in simpler terms, it means that for every 3.3 million light years further away, a galaxy is from us. It's moving about 70 kilometers per second faster. So what does this mean for the future of our universe? Well, if the expansion continues unabated, the universe will keep getting bigger and colder. Galaxies will drift further apart until they're beyond the reach of our telescopes. In the far, far future, any civilizations born in distant galaxies will look up at the night sky and see only their home galaxy. The rest of the universe will be lost to them. Yes, the universe is getting bigger every second, and we are part of this cosmic expansion. It's a mind-bending concept, isn't it? But that's the reality of the cosmos we inhabit. Our universe, a vast cosmic balloon, ceaselessly inflating, carrying us along on its grand silent journey. Did you know that space is silent? Well, there's a reason for that. Imagine being at a rock concert. The music is blaring, the crowd is cheering, and you can feel the energy in the air. Now, this is because sound travels through the air by vibrating the molecules around us. These vibrations reach our ears and our brains interpret them as sound. In space, however, it's a different story. You see, space is a vacuum, meaning it's devoid of matter. It lacks the molecules that sound needs to travel. So even if you were to set off a firework in space, you wouldn't hear a thing. That's because there are no molecules in the vacuum of space to vibrate and carry the sound waves to your ears. But don't mistake silence for tranquility. Space may be silent, but it's not completely quiet. There are electromagnetic vibrations that constantly ripple through the vacuum of space. These vibrations, too minute for the human ear to perceive, can be picked up by special instruments and converted into sounds we can hear. So while it's true that in space, no one can hear you scream, it doesn't mean space is an absolute quiet zone. It's a symphony of electromagnetic vibrations, just waiting to be heard. In the grand scheme of the universe, even the loudest explosion would be completely silent. What if we told you that we can only see about 5% of the universe? That's right. The stars, planets, galaxies, and everything else we can observe make up just a tiny fraction of the cosmos. The rest, a whopping 95%, is made up of something we can't see. This unseen portion of the universe is filled with mysterious substances known as dark matter and dark energy. Let's take a moment to unravel this cosmic mystery. Dark matter and dark energy are like the universe's invisible scaffolding. They shape the universe, dictate the structure of galaxies, and are responsible for the universe's ever-accelerating expansion. Despite their invisible nature, these extraordinary forces leave an indelible mark on the cosmos. But how can we be so sure about something we can't see? Well, the existence of dark matter and dark energy is supported by a range of compelling evidence. For instance, gravitational lensing, 
a phenomenon where light bends around massive objects reveals the presence of dark matter. Meanwhile, the rapid expansion of the universe suggests the existence of a force counteracting gravity, what we call dark energy. Yet despite this evidence, dark matter and dark energy remain enigmatic. We don't know what they're made of or why they exist. Scientists around the globe are working tirelessly, using cutting-edge technology and complex mathematical models in a bid to solve these cosmic mysteries. So, when we gaze up at the night sky, we're not just looking at the stars, we're peering into a universe filled with unseen forces, a universe where the visible is just the tip of the cosmic iceberg. And as we continue to probe the depths of the cosmos, who knows what other mysteries we'll uncover. Dark matter and dark energy remain some of the universe's biggest unsolved mysteries, invisible yet overwhelmingly present. Ever wondered what the universe's oldest light looks like? Picture this, a faint glow permeating the cosmos, nearly undetectable, yet holding immeasurable value. This is the Cosmic Microwave Background Radiation, or CMBR for short, the universe's oldest light, born almost 14 billion years ago, just a few hundred thousand years after the Big Bang. CMBR is a relic of the universe's fiery infancy. It's like a cosmic whisper, echoing the universe's first cries. This radiation is a snapshot of the universe when it was young, hot, and dense. As the universe expanded and cooled, this energy stretched and faded, becoming the faint microwave glow we detect today. The discovery of the CMBR was a landmark event in cosmology, providing crucial evidence for the Big Bang Theory. You see, if the universe did indeed start with a hot, dense phase as the Big Bang Theory suggests, there should be some afterglow, and that's exactly what the CMBR is. Studying the CMBR is like being a cosmic archaeologist, sifting through the remnants of the universe's explosive birth. The minute fluctuations in this radiation reveal the seeds of galaxies and clusters of galaxies, helping us understand how the universe evolved from its smooth, hot beginnings to the structured cosmos we observe today. So, the universe's oldest light is still around, whispering tales of the cosmos's fiery birth.